Hello everybody and welcome back to another video on Realm Simulator. On my channel we've currently made at least five videos so far in Realm and I've loved it ever since. This game is so fun and we are actually back with a new update and new daily rewards. As you guys can see they've updated to, to everything that's better from the new world from the previous area such as this elder by the way legendary goaded. Um, now that they actually you know, we're going to claim these first, and I'm going to talk to you. They actually increased the cap for every pet slash us to level 130. So now you can see that level 100 isn't the max no more, and we can go to 130. And I sort of want to tell you, the cap between 100, it's changing to 130, is a big, big change. Because now that we have that, our pets could go to something crazier. I mean, look, 7 trillion, we are barely reaching 100 billion. And now that we know level 130 elder is like 42 billion power, it is insane. And I'm basically gonna go throughout leveling up all my elders, leveling up all my legendaries I get, and sort of just playing through this update like I normally do. Now there is other stuff like a daily chest, and we also can see that there's this thing called a no event active. It is a golden winds event though, 100% an hour. So you go to this, you click, and you can summon golden wind, and this will give you a 100% increase of, well, I don't know yet, I'm guessing coins, um, I'm guessing stuff like XP, who knows. But we do also have, now that our coins are sort of better to see, guys, it was sort of a huge number, now we got just 27 trillion. But boom, we're going to claim this. I don't know how much, much coins that was, but uh, we'll take it. Uh, and we also do have a new backpack, and now I'm going to guess I have enough to purchase this. Boom, we do. 1.8 trillion, not the craziest price. Going to be honest, thought they would increase it to be something crazy, but at the same time, not everyone is um, grinding as much as us, I guess you could say. But now that we bought that, we can now equip, well, I don't think it increases your equipped. No, it doesn't. But it does increase your pet inventory, sword inventory, and other stuff, so we'll take that. Um, next, backpacks are, there's only three, so I don't know what's coming next, but we're gonna go check out this new area, guys. Let's go to the Sky Realm, let's go to the last, uh, you know, little spot. We're gonna go jump over there, and I'll see you guys once again. All right, now we are back and we are at this portal, 300 billion, we're gonna buy it. This is the Sinister Slime Shrine. Okay, so that means we're gonna see some uh, slimes. Now we do have to be level 100, which is pretty common to know. Uh, it's always the max level from the previous world. And then Sinister Slime, all right, so we do have these guys around over here. We're gonna go ahead and I guess take out a couple. Where is my auto swing? We put this. Now there's a stat button, guys. We actually, do, or sorry, not stats, but index. Wait, this is actually amazing, guys. We have a whole new thing now to sort of review over these. This index is actually way helpful because we can see now there's actually one, there's two legendaries in this new area, and that's pretty good to know. It doesn't seem like anything's better than legendary steals, but we will be getting all of these pets, all of these weapons going through this. So, so far we have the god in the common. Let's check out the stats of this. We have a grave slicer, 250 million. So it, obviously the first commons aren't going to be the greatest, but with combinations in the blacksmith, we can increase that to get the better weapons. But I say I'm fairly strong with my elders right now to be able to handle these whisk, wisp, I guess you could I guess pronounce them. Now I do know that when it comes to XP guys, you're actually not gonna wanna farm these guys, I'm guessing. You're probably gonna wanna farm the previous world unless they change something about that. And it looks like we only have to be level 105 to get this place, and I'm guessing the next would be like 120 something, who knows. Uh, but another thing they did add is they buffed the magnet, which honestly hype around that because the magnet was a little odd with working. I think they also fixed uh, the quick attack, let's see. Uh, let's go around this with auto attack. Sorry. Looks like all the pets now go instead of just singular ones So that is a huge W that was sort of uh, disappointing not to have a work uh, Now I don't know if these daily rewards are gonna give other stuff besides coins. I do hope so it looks for now like they aren't um, I don't know if there's a new code there, if there is guys I will be grabbing that code and posting it in this video somewhere if there isn't then I'm sorry um, but they did change a lot of stuff which honestly W to the stabs. They have a lot of stuff coming in mind. I do know dungeons will be coming sooner or later, and I can't wait. 
Um, so definitely hype around that. We're gonna go ahead and take out a bunch of these sinister slimes and other mobs in general, though, guys, as we normally do, and then skip over to once we reach level 105, check out the other mobs, and just keep going along that, and we complete this index for you guys. So as you saw, it was sort of right 120. So I'll see you guys back once we've completed so much. All right, now, guys, we went ahead and reached level 105, and we also basically used all of our coins in hatching. Now, the prices sort of actually were fixed, I guess, for eggs, because it's 13 billion around, I think, to hatch per, and my coin just went evaporated through, I mean, 24 trillion, just like that. Obviously, we're going to be needing a lot to grind, and now we're going to go ahead and activate this shrine, and before we go through all these mobs, such as, I guess they're all just called Undead Army, aren't they? Uh, or the rancid roach um i want to go over and show you guys already just a couple of levels six levels in from being base level of 100 and having 500 million goes to double that in five levels and that really just shows how insane the difference is and how powerful you can get now with these and it's going to show how strong these upcoming bosses are going to be in the next shrine that i need to you know level up to be which is 120 so just five or sorry about 15 levels away from that now we're gonna go ahead and start taking some of these out we're gonna put on our auto swing let's go see what we get now i do have auto delete here so i'm obviously not gonna get into commons so we're gonna change that up because i do want to see what the commons and rares and uncommons are in this area of zombies whatever uh so we have the ebon steel blade and now i do see this as a different one so the commons are basically double the previous ones which is to be expected and if we go to the index now, which honestly enjoyable to have, um, we can sort of take into consideration that these guys are going to be giving... Okay, so we could get everything up, like up to this new legendary that we can now get that we couldn't previously get. I actually didn't know you could get the rares and epics. I guess they're just hard to get off of the common uh, first one and two were, um, I guess, mobs, you could say. Now, it does seem that we're getting a good amount of XP. Now, if you are struggling to get to 105, guys, just know that you're supposed to be farming the previous world boss. Um, as usual, when it comes to coming through the underworld and all the other stuff, uh, the Skyrim as well, it's going to, you know, just be farming the previous world boss to get to the first shrine. So, other than that, I did actually notice that we have some epics from hatching the Skull Army, guys. Now, the base level um, at 100 is 173 million. Um, and going up to 105, you, you know, started to see the double in it, just five levels and it doubles. So we sort of guess sooner or later it's going to go higher into the billions at level 130. But it's sort of not going to be as good as a legendary. So that's as well, you know, sort of why you want to purely farm legendaries. But you also can farm your epics along the way, sort of level them up if you have nothing else to level up and you just want to do that. But I advise to always just, you know, keep a bunch of... Uh, legendaries and then level them up all at an instant if you do have some things such as this you know cosmic mystery backpack that I still need to purchase because I think they updated it to have 12 plus equipped now guys if I am correct please comment down below and tell me and another thing to comment down below is how you are enjoying this game so far do you guys like it if so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video because that helps me so much making more content on these type of games and another thing is join up in my Discord. I'm sort of re-happy it into Community for Realms. It used to be for Sword Fighter. Honestly, it was just something I want to make as a community for you guys all to just chit-chat about anything. So go join up in that, and I'll see you guys all probably in there. Um, but other than that, we're going to go ahead and keep seeing what we're getting. We're sort of just basically getting pure commons, which is a little disgusting. So we're going to go ahead and delete all of these. Actually, no, we're not, guys. We're going to go over here. And it does look like we barely have 200 billion, but if I am correct, this should be enough. If it isn't, then I'm just going to skip over to you guys once I get better weapons. But this should be enough to upgrade something in the blacksmith, if I'm correct. If not, then holy, the price is insane. So let's see. We're going to put five of these. A rare, perfect. So it does cost 336 billion more, so we're probably going to go ahead and farm up tons of coins, do a bunch of combinations, get an epic then grind from there so once again i'll see you guys once we've completed this all right guys now we are back with the last shrine in the new shrine shrine in the new area <laughs> um we have the specter's minion level 120 boom we've have unlocked 
every new mob and now we just have to get every new best weapon now we didn't get the legendary from previous mobs because well my luck just isn't crazy but we did get two of these epics skull crushers five million insane um and obviously i've seen sneak peeks of how strong the best legendary is 120 billion that is insane and a boom already 11 billion on these elders at just close to not even max level so as you sort of imagine nine more levels in insane boost uh, also skull army going to be around 20 billion i'd say more or less um but leveling to 130 is going to be a hefty thing to do but it is going to be something to do a long time and that is going to be enjoyable and i didn't notice that throughout your daily rewards they give you better stuff uh, or the stuff based on the realm you're in once you've unlocked it so as you guys saw in the beginning we had elder here and now we have this guy so i could go ahead and claim like day one but i didn't i didn't i claimed day one for the previous area so not this one so if they did allow you to claim both that would be crazy because that was a little broken system i could have done there um but we're gonna go ahead and start taking out these specter minions you know checking out the commons every weapon here let's go ahead because these weapons are better and uh I'm, if i don't get anything i guess insane at the start i obviously am going to show you guys and skip to the sort of end game loot again uh just to keep you guys you know saving your time here um but we do have some uncommons already 6.6 .6 ghost piercer the common is already better than my two skull crushers so we're going to go ahead and equip this and that is just insane jesus the commons are better so sort of imagine the rare that we just got 8 billion boom even crazier and we're i guess we're just gonna fuse these commons later on and hopefully get some epics because we already have one rare so that's sort of good on our luck and i don't have any luck potions but we have xp potions the max level is 130 so that is good to know now yeah it looks like we're not getting any crazy weapons pure commons and rares so I'm once again going to just skip to you guys once we're done here and show you guys the legendary weapon and the legendary pet and just show you guys what the pet will probably be at once it's maxed and sort of show you guys what my plan is for some ongoing videos. So I'll see you guys once again in a second. Alright guys, now finally we are back after I'll be honest like two hours of grinding. We have gotten the legendary shadow scythe. This is the best weapon in the new realm area as of now so basically this is a 0.4 chance of getting we now have basically every percent of like weapons pets what the chances are of getting showing as we do have the index and talking about index i want to go over i do have the legendary but i also want to talk about these rewards i didn't notice this but there's actually rewards for completing each different um you know realms like i guess index you just get these you know luck xp luck oh wait, that's luck that's gold um and damage etc and along the line we have the shadow which is actually the legendary pet which i find crazy but at the end of it you sort of realize probably by the time i have this legendary weapon i'll probably um have a, a legendary pet a couple of them at least um may or may not now i just noticed i don't know why the chances for the legendary weapon oh wait no that's this is easier to get off of this one than it is the other ones. So yeah, it sort of shows the boss is really the best. And I'm going to be making a video of me completing every reward on the index. So if you guys are, you know, sort of expecting to see that, make sure to turn notifications on. And now I want to go over the pet. Now we do have the Shadow Seeker right here. Level 130, max it out for you guys. 51.12 billion. And that is just crazy. Now I do want to check my spot before the end of this video on a leaderboard because i wasn't playing for four days guys as you guys saw i was making sfs content and uh, i sort of delayed myself there but i shouldn't be too far off from this leaderboard if i am right um wow this guy almost has a similar name than me now if i am correct with this i should have about 200 300 400 500 600 600 billion around there um and i'm actually surprised i don't see myself here now i may just be blind but other than that i mean it's probably just going to update sooner or later and i'll see myself and i'll leave that up to you know the leaderboard to reset but hopefully you guys did enjoy this video i sure do enjoy making content on this game um and if you guys 
you know, enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and I'll be seeing you guys all in the next video. Peace out.